Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got a three by three array of uh, empty boxes, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that if we add or subtract uh, these boxes uh, horizontally, we are supposed to get uh, 45, 6, uh, and uh, 18. Whereas if we add or subtract uh, vertically, we are supposed to get uh, 21, 27, and uh, 30. And furthermore, uh, this uh, specific uh, box has a value x. And now our task is uh, to find the value of uh, this uh, x only. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first step we are going to do. Let's go ahead and label uh, these uh, boxes. Let me go ahead and label this box uh, as a lowercase a, this uh, lowercase b, lowercase uh, c, lowercase d, e, f, g, and uh, h. And now we will try to manipulate uh, these uh, boxes in such a way that we could find the value of uh, this box x. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, first uh, row of these uh, boxes. I am going to add them. As you can see in this uh, equation, I have added a plus uh, b plus x, as you can see over here. And now let me go ahead and combine these uh, next uh, row of uh, boxes. As you can see in this uh, next equation, I just wrote down c plus d minus e equal to 6. Now let's go ahead and combine this uh, next uh, row. As you can see in this uh, next equation, I wrote down f minus g plus h equals to 18. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and combine them, uh, this uh, column. As you can see in this uh, next equation, a plus c plus f equals to 21. And now let's combine this uh, next uh, column. As you can see in this uh, next uh, equation, b plus d minus g equals to 27. And finally, let's combine this uh, third uh, column. As you can see in this uh, next uh, equation, uh, x uh, plus e minus h uh, equals to 30. Let me go ahead and call this our equation number 1, this our equation number 2, number 3, number 4, equation number 5 and finally equation number 6. So we got all 6 uh, total number of equations. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and add uh, all uh, these uh, equations uh, up. And if we examine these equations uh, closely, we can see that this uh, negative e and this uh, positive e, they are gone. Likewise, uh, this positive h uh, cancel with this uh, negative h so they are gone as well now let's focus on uh, a we got a over here and a over here let's go ahead and add the map we are going to get uh, 2 times a plus uh, let's focus on this uh, next b is over here and b is over here as well so b plus b is going to give us uh, 2 times a b and then uh, plus uh, x and we got another x over here that is going to give us uh, plus uh, 2x and now let's focus on this c and we got uh, another c over here if we combine them we are going to get uh, plus uh, 2c and then plus uh, this uh, d and this uh, one more d over here that is going to give us uh, 2 times uh, d and then we got uh, this uh, f and this another f uh, that is going to make uh, plus uh, 2f uh, and finally minus g and we got uh, minus g as well so that is going to make uh, minus uh, 2g equals to and now on the right hand side we are going to add 45 plus 6 plus 18 plus uh, 21 plus uh, 27 plus 30. If we add them, we are going to get 147 on the right hand side. And here's our next step. We can see 2 is in common across the board on the left hand side. 
So let me go ahead and factor out uh, two outside and we are going to get uh, inside bracket uh, a plus uh, b plus x plus c plus d plus f minus g equals to 147 on the right hand side and here's our next step let me go ahead and write down two outside and let me go ahead and rearrange these terms i'm gonna write x faster over here plus and now I'm going to add uh, A plus C plus F uh, together. Let me go ahead and write down A plus uh, C plus uh, F and then uh, plus. Uh, and now I'm going to combine uh, B plus D minus G. Let me go ahead and write down uh, B plus uh, D minus G equals to 147 and now let's focus on this part uh, a plus c plus uh, f and if we focus on this equation uh, 4 we can see a plus c plus f equals to 21 so therefore i'm going to replace uh, this part by 21 and now let's focus on this uh, next uh, terms b plus d minus g and let's focus on equation 5 we can see b plus d minus g equals to 27 so i'm going to replace this one by 27 so therefore let's go ahead and substitute uh, 2 and then x uh, and after substitution this is going to become 21 plus uh, 27 equals to 100 and 47 and now let's go ahead and combine the like terms so 2 times uh, x uh, plus uh, 48 uh, equals to 147 and now let's go ahead and distribute uh, this uh, 2 and since we are running out the space uh, on the right hand side so i'm going to write down over here after the distribution we get uh, 2x uh, plus uh, 96 uh, equal to 147 and now let's go ahead and subtract uh, 96 from both sides this is gone on the left hand side so we ended up with the 2x equals to 51 on the right hand side and finally let's go ahead and divide both sides by 2 to isolate x so this 2 and 2 is gone so therefore our this x value turns out to be 51 divided by 2 so thus our x value turns out to be 51 divided by 2 and that could also be written as x equals to 25.5 and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye